when you feel low, you can still go. Even when you feel slow, you can still go. Even when there's no hope, you can still go. I never ran to the known man, I still go. Go, go. Welcome to Bike Talk. Today we are going to talk about Kawasaki Ninja ZX6R. Recently Kawasaki released Ninja ZX6R updated version for 2024. Previous version of this bike was discontinued because of Euro 5 regulation affected. However this new one has fulfilled the requirement and can sell in European market. So it's great to see it back and here are the 6 key things that you need to know about it. Design Motorcycle come up with two different models, Standard and KRD Edition. Standard model got two colors changers including metallic flats park black and pearl robotic white. Also KRD Edition come with only one color changers it is eye-catching lime green plus ebony. It features all new smooth flowing super sport styling with 3D interwoven bodywork. The new front and side cowls, new sporty windscreen, and all LED lighting create the recognizable ninja look. The new blacked out engine covers and muffler body add to the sporty look of the super sport. Engine. It got 639cc liquid cooled in line for engine capable of produce 124 horsepower peak at 13,000 it is little bit less power to compare with previous version. It may be fulfilled the new emission regulation. Still this power is enough to be the most powerful motorcycle in this 600cc class. Chassis. It got twin spark cast aluminum frame similar to previous version. Front suspension is 41mm inverted fork with rebound and compression damping and spring preload adjustability. Also fully adjustable gas charged shock at the rear front brake, you got 310mm dual front discs with dual radial mounted for piston mana block calipers at the rear, it is 220mm single pedal discs with single piston caliper. Electronics Electronic used in this bike can divide into two parts. Engine Management Technology and Chassis Management Technology Under Engine Management Technology it has some technologies. First one is Assist and Slipper Clutch. This allows to total clutch spring load to be reduced, resulting in a lighter clutch lever feel. Second one is Economic Riding Indicator. You can identify current riding condition are consuming a low amount of fuel. If it is, an eco mark appears on modern digital display. Third one Kawasaki Quick Shifter. Here only you got quick upshifts, no downshift. This allow you to maximum acceleration on or off the track. Fourth one power modes. You got three level of power modes. It allow you to easily select engine power delivery to suit riding condition. Finally smartphone connectivity. This allows riders to connect to their motorcycle wirelessly using Kawasaki Rideology app. Access riding logs including DPS route, gear position, RPM. Also telephone call or display on the instrument panel. Under chassis management technology, you got ABS system that prevents wheel lockup during braking, thereby enhancing safety and improving the bike's overall stability. 600cc motorcycle market was very competitive in the past. You have many choices to select. But Euro 5 regulation hit this class and Yamaha R7 and Suzuki GSX R600 discontinued their production. Now it is only Honda CBR650R and Aprilia RS660. The Honda CBR650R is a more comfortable and versatile alternative to the ZX6R. It has a more upright riding position, making it more comfortable for long rides. If you are looking a sport bike for long distance riding, maybe CBR for you. Aprilia RS660 is very good bike, excellent handling, comfortable for long distance also come up with full of electronic package. But it is power not enough to beat ZX6R. Dimensions. You can see the sum of dimension specifications about the bike. Thanks for watching. Please keep with us for more about the super bikes. Please subscribe, like, and share with your friends.